So I've got two tools I'm going to show you here. Uh, both of them use AirPlay to let me share my uh, iOS device screen on my desktop, which is really good for testing because I can do testing on the iOS device. I can project the screen onto my desktop computer and use the normal screen recording tools that I use on my computer. So here I'm using Camtasia to record my desktop screen. So I'm going to show you AirServer from airserver.com and this is Reflector from airsquirrel.com. Both of these tools are incredibly cheap. They're about $12.99 and $14.99 at the moment. And both of them do much the same thing. They act as AirPlay servers. So I'm going to switch on AirPlay, mirror the device, and there we go. So here is AirServer running, and it's showing you my iOS device there. So the way that the AirPlay stuff works, remember, is if, it, if I just do a swipe up from the bottom of the screen, We've got our basic settings, then we can do the AirPlay off where you can see the, the Office Dell XPS there. That would normally say AirPlay if I haven't connected. Then I can use my iOS device as normal and we'll see the basic actions that I'm doing on the iOS device reflected on the actual desktop screen so I can record as I'm doing my testing. Now it's hard to know which of these tools is the best here. This might not be the best demo, I'm pointing out these tools so that you can go away and have a look at them. So AirServer has quite a lot of options in it. And I haven't used any of these settings, they seem to work fine. I'm just running this AirServer in demo mode here. AirServer comes with a, a seven day demo. So if I shut down AirServer, then move over to Reflector. So Reflector comes with a, a demo where uh, when you try it, you essentially get 10 minutes of sharing time. So if I go back to my iOS device, switch on AirPlay and mirroring, we should see that up here. And there we go, let me just resize this. Both of them, you can resize the window when they come through. And again, let's get rid of this. Now I found that Reflector uh, didn't require as much prerequisites, so I just I didn't need to install iTunes or anything else. But uh, Air Server required iTunes. Once you've got those installed, it's fine. I think it's really going to come down to whichever one works best on your uh, machine as to which one you use. But in terms of being able to see your device on your main screen and be able to capture it out of the box, it comes with AirPlay. Therefore, we should try and harness that for our testing. It's designed for Apple TVs, but both AirServer and Reflector act as AirPlay servers, so we can project our devices onto that. And we can basically do our testing, um, mess around on the actual device screen, record the testing that we're doing. I suggest you have a look at both tools, see which one works best in your particular environment, and then you can start recording your test sessions when you do them on device.